Hey guys, welcome to this new lesson of the course. It's going to be a quite short and quick lesson where we'll be looking for references of robots in order to use them for our illustrations. As you can see, I'm on Pinterest website and I'm going to search here the references I'm looking for. Okay, so let's type on the search box the word makeup and from the results we got, I'll pick some pictures that I'll be using afterwards as inspiration for my illustration. You'll notice that after typing the word, we'll get lots of images of robots or mechanical articulated pieces and also other devices that can be used as a reference. For instance, these over here, whose appearance and composition are quite not worthy, right? Not all robots have the same aspect. We, well, at least in my case, I'll be opting for a humanoid aspect, which is adapted so that a person can wear this structure. As if it were a kind of suit or costume. Kind of, right? In particular, I want my robot has the anatomy of an animal. So I'll be using these images you see here. For example, this one, which is inspired by a grasshopper, and this one whose structure has been adapted so that it can be worn by a human. And there are other pictures like this one, for instance, which has been based on a, an organic element, a mushroom actually. And here we have Overwatch characters. Uh, this one is a robot and automaton and is to legged. This one, however, is a mecha. It's a robot that has been adapted in order for a human to wear it. And this is based on an animal. Well, guys, this lesson ends up here. See you in the next one.